I good um many with PFL driving school. Can a pregnant woman take driving lesson, learn how to drive? In fact, let me be more specific. Can a seven month old pregnant woman take driving lesson? We have this um we have this um scenario and we have this question coming. I said let me do a video about it and answer it, right? Now um I've seen it big time pregnant woman doing what this year in New York City with the DMV. And I even went further, further more and, and read up on it and to investigate, make sure that, make sure that my answer was, will be, will be right. Yes, pregnant women can do less than up to eight months. Whenever pregnant, whatever pregnant level that you are, you can still um, learn how to drive and take your word test with no issue. However, if there is any complication, any issue with your pregnancy, whatever the case may be, you need to check with your physician first to know if you can continue doing your lesson or take your word test if there is any complication. That's the only instance that you may not want to continue doing lesson if there's complication, whatever the complication may be, right? But if there is no complication for whatsoever, everything is good health condi um health condition good shape and um, everything is good it shouldn't be any reason for you to start um um, um to stop doing less in fact that's good exercising for you to learn how to drive while you're pregnant however that would be a good activities to get yourself involved if you wanted to take the advantage of doing that in that season but besides that it should not be any issue for you not to be able to take driving lesson. Reason I'm saying that, we had that situation. Um, the student said that um, 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 they're pregnant. They wanna know if they can continue or pause their lesson after they have their, ba um, their baby. Before I give the answer, I make sure I investigate. I ask um, where I have to ask, and I look up where I have to look up and get the answer. I said, you know what, let me share the answer. If one person got that worries, worries, I, said, I guess many people may have the same worry as well. So we share the answer with you here so we all can um, benefit from that in fact if you guys know anyone that is going to that situation and that same problem occurred put in the comment below let me know how is that handled but as far as i know it shouldn't be any issue for whatsoever for any pregnant woman to um take driving lesson while they're pregnant as long as there is no health issue there is nothing preventing them from taking the lesson it should not be any issue all right so let me know in the comment below your thoughts if anything um if that ever occurred to you if you know anything that has been um that has been occurring in that situation where the person have to start taking lesson. Okay, if you're new here, uh, my name is Ben with Pierre Paul Driving School. We are, um, uh, this, in this channel, you, you will learn anything about driving. So if you're new here, you may consider to subscribe and hit the notification bell. So each time that we drop a video, you'll be the first one to be notified. In fact, if you have any question, anything you want me to cover in particular as you relate to driving, put in the comment below. That's where we have most of our video topic coming from we are located here in the new york in the new york area so if you happen to be in those area you want people driving school to help you in any driving endeavor check our website the link is in the description check our website and see how we can benefit you every morning they posted three days in this channel every two every monday wednesday and friday every monday wednesday and friday and also we uh we answer questions every morning first hour in the morning our first lesson we dedicate that to answer a question and we do lesson around the students area that we're picking up if you happen to live in the new york area you want us to do a video on your the area that you live in you can go in the comment below and put that in if you sign up with us you want us to do a lesson while we're picking you up we can do that as well we're going to continue as our day we clear out the question that was for the day we continue as our day showing the left and rights and turn that to do as a driver and think also that to do as a student so if you have a with test coming up so you can take your with test and pass with no issue remember driving requires some strong responsibility it is our duty to educate ourselves as much as we can so that we can benefit from the thing that we have no control of we only can control so much while we're driving the thing that we have no control of we try our best to prevent from trouble as much as we can, all right? So, the Sunday morning here, we have lesson started from 6 a.m. to almost um, to all, the way, to all the way down to 11 p.m. in the night, seven days a week, all right? You can get picked up and dropped off depending on the location that you live in the New York City area. Where's come to, um, um, and the event that we don't pick you up, you can always come to the office. We will, we will serve you as well. In fact, 
it'll be best when you come to the office because the area where the office is located at is very suited for for student however if you're gonna do your work test because it's depending on the location that you live it may be crowded or whatever the case may be can um, prevent you to do certain stuff coming to the office is the best option however but we do pick up and drop off in um in, um, in brooklyn as well all right so um any question again put in the comment below until then let's keep doing our regular routine left and right observations and you guys if i always ask you guys for help if i see something that i if i miss something you guys see it for me while i'm driving because there's a lot of things going on here as i'm showing those videos put in the comment below so next time i can be more more careful around those things all right as i'm coming ahead i already see a car is double parking on my right side i'm gonna signal to my left and cover my brake. We do not drive on traffic. For the purpose of the wood test, we do not drive on traffic. The traffic has to be clear first, okay? You're gonna do me one left, shoulder left, and go around. Those are wood test tips, okay? But in real life, people don't have time for that. Signal the same way back again. In real life, people don't have time for that. They will give us big time trouble. They want us to continue to drive, but we don't do that. We know for wood test, we cannot drive onto traffic, okay? And never do something that you're not sure of. Do not let people intimidate you making you do stuff to get in trouble especially if you're doing your work test because you're going to stack with the result you're going to stack with the job with the trouble they're going to continue on with their day i've seen it in numerous occasions i said let me bring that for you student the guys to understand that okay you are the driver you are in charge all right you make the decision that you deem is safe for you to make while you're behind the steering wheel somebody else is driving then that's the problem when you're driving either you're taking your work test however it doesn't change if you even doing your work test you felt a situation is not safe for you to do do not do it you are in charge it is what it is you are in charge not the dmv examiner not the instructor you are in charge. i don't feel safe doing this i'm not gonna do it because even you doing the lesson you get in trouble guess who stuck with the trouble you are you're doing the work test to get in trouble. Guess you're stuck with the trouble. You are. So I will make the decision that I feel that I'm safe. If that makes sense, let me know in the comment below if anything you want to say contrary to that, if I'm missing something so we can explain that better. I've always told the student, you are in charge. The examiner next to you, just giving you the guidance where to make left and right. The DMV, um, the instructor next to you, give you the guidance and show you how to drive. But if even anything were to happen, you are fully responsible because you are the driver. Many students taking that since they drive, they're learning to drive, they exempt from it. No, you're not. Okay? You're learning to drive, you have to drive the correct way. Whoever around you, they're just there to give you the guidance. I want to make sure I get that straight with you guys, all right? All right, making the right turn at this traffic light here. You stop when you start when you start losing the first white line. Anything you guys want me to cover in particular, put in the comment below. All right, as this channel here, we are all about driving. For the purpose of the wood test, whenever you turn, you need to check me was in shoulder and make your turn. Before fully engage this, okay, there's something with the light here. The, the light is green. Oh, the hands is green because they had a shortage here with the cold in New York City. And, okay, it's good. Remember, I showed the right, make the turn. They had a shortage here in New York City with the cold, and we got a few cold days. The power went out and a lot of people were suffering. Okay, this is one over here. You see it? This is one over here. It's blinking. This thing went out. You have to you have to be very cautious going on here to see what's going on. You see? Yellow lights mean proceed with caution. You see the car already going around me. Don't have time for that. Not seeing that the light is yellow. Okay? That's what I was talking about, folks. And it's, it comes another one. See? It becomes a um, blinking yellow light. You have to proceed with caution. I think this power is out too. It's been since yesterday. They have not yet done anything to cover this thing. Okay, and this is big um, um, America. All right, this one is working. Making a right turn here. So it's working here. We will right, shoulder right, and make your turn nice and smooth, covering the brick and fall right into place. All right. All right, folks, there you have it. I'm coming to the student house. I'm going to pull over right here. Any, every morning, you have a question, put in the comment below. That's where we have most of our questions answered 
early in the morning for you guys so you can get clarity if anything bothers you that you have not control over, all right? So um, until then, folks, keep practicing. Just been here with Pierre Paul Driving School. We are everything about driving in any shape or form that we can help you. We do our best to give you as best as best content that we can provide for you. You can follow us with all with and all of the other social platform. We are there showing the same content as well. Share this video to Facebook group to uh, YouTube um, to any groups that you know may benefit from that. Because as you can help somebody to get the license here in the U.S., that's one of the strongest gifts you can give them. Although they may not use driving for a living, but the type of life they can open for those people, it's tremendously valuable. All right. So if you're new here. You may consider to subscribe and hit the notification bell so each time that we drop a video you'll be the first one to be um notified remember driving requires some strong responsibility it is you and i responsibility to educate ourselves to the most of our ability because in the event that anything were to be to, to happen while we're driving we'll be fully responsible for that until then folks keep practicing this is Benny with pierre paul driving school take care now bye bye